warm and I did and I thought I'm running am I running a fever I was boiling hot and sweating and then I was cold and I had I, I, I was out for the count for about a week Eric Clapton is an English rock and blues guitarist, singer, and composer who's widely regarded as one of the greatest and most influential guitarists of all time. Clapton was named second on Rolling Stone's 100 Greatest Guitarists of All Time list and fourth on Gibson's Top 50 Guitarists of All Time list. In 2009, he was ranked fifth on Time Magazine's list of the 10 best electric guitar players. In Clapton's long career, he's played more than 3,000 concerts in nearly 60 countries. And though he retired from worldwide touring in 2015, he continues to make new music, and he celebrated his 70th birthday with shows at New York City's Madison Square Garden and London's Royal Albert Hall. My hands didn't really work. They were, I suffer from a condition already called peripheral neuropathy, which is nerve damage pain, really. If you enjoy these videos, please remember to hit the like button as it does help us out a lot. And comment below who your favorite celebrity is that you'd love to see in an upcoming video. His full name is Eric Patrick Clapton, but is also known as Eric Clapton. He was born March 30th, 1945 in Ripley, Surrey, England, making him 76 at the time of this production. He stands five feet, nine inches tall. Eric Clapton has a number of hobbies, including reading books and traveling. Besides, he's fond of collecting art pieces. His art collection is very difficult to value. He has an extremely keen eye for art and has picked up pieces throughout his career for relative pittances compared to what they could fetch today. For example, the three Gerhard Richter paintings he bought at once in 2001 for $3.4 million and eventually sold for a combined $77.3 million. Other pieces in his collection include Edgar Degas, La Samael, Henry Matisse, Nu Debout, Maurice Oltrio's La Bouquet. Eric Clapton dated Betty Davis, a funk singer, for a short time. In 1979, he married Patty Boyd, but their relationship was tainted by his infidelity and domestic abuse. Clapton has admitted in an interview to raping and assaulting her while they were married as he was a full-blown drunk. Besides, Clapton established a relationship with Yvonne Kelly, the manager of Air Studios Montserrat, in 1984 while recording Behind the Sun. They had a daughter in January 1985, despite the fact that they were both married to different partners at the time. Ruth Kelly Clapton was her name, but she was kept hidden from the public until the media discovered she was his kid in 1991. Clapton and Boyd tried repeatedly to conceive, even attempting in vitro fertilization in 1984, but miscarriages were the result. They separated in 1989 when he confessed to having an affair with Italian model Lori Del Santo and getting her pregnant, which she described as utterly devastating. Del Santo gave birth to their son, Connor. Connor was four years old when he died on March 20th, 1991, when he fell out of an open bedroom window on the 53rd story of a Manhattan apartment building. Clapton, then 53, met Melia McInerney, a 22-year-old administrative assistant at a party thrown for him following a concert in Columbus, Ohio. He dated her quietly for a year before making the relationship public in 1999. Clapton's birthplace, Ripley, hosted their wedding on January 1, 2002 at St. Mary Magdalene Church. They have three children, including Julie Rose, born June 13, 2001, Ella May, born January 14, 2003, and Sophie Bell, born February 1, 2005. I probably shouldn't have had the first jab, but then I was offered the second. And I thought, well, what have I got? What's the point in, you know, stopping now? When Eric Clapton was born, his mother, Patricia, was just 16 years old, and his father, Edward, was a 24-year-old Canadian soldier who Eric has never met. As a child, Clapton was told that Patricia was his sister and that her mother and stepfather were Eric's parents. When Patricia later married and moved to Germany, she left Clapton in England with his grandparents. Eric learned how to play guitar as a teenager after receiving one as a birthday gift, and his skills were so impressive that he was performing in pubs with fellow musician Dave Brock by the age of 16. He joined a British R&B group, The Roosters, at 17 and performed with them until August 1963. 
Later that year, he played several gigs with Casey Jones and the Engineers. Clapton attended the Kingston College of Art, but was expelled after his first year. Eric joined the Yardbirds in October 1963 and stayed with the band until March 1965, leaving on the day the band released their first big hit, For Your Love. In April 1965, Clapton joined John Mayall and the Blues Breakers, left a few months later, rejoined the band in November, and quit again in July 1966. After leaving the Blues Breakers, Eric joined Cream and released six albums and several hit singles with them, including Sunshine of Your Love and White Room, before Cream disbanded in 1968. The following year, he formed Blind Faith with Steve Winwood, Ginger Baker, and Rick Gregg, but the band was only together for seven months. Clapton then formed Derek and the Dominoes, releasing Layla, which would become one of his most popular songs in 1970, and the group disbanded in 1971 during the recording of their second album. In 1974, Eric put together a touring band and recorded the album's 461 Ocean Boulevard, which included his first number one hit, a cover of Bob Marley's I Shot the Sheriff. He took a break from music in 1982 to go to rehab and started working on the album Money and Cigarettes a few months after being discharged. In the 1980s, Clapton began composing film scores, winning a BAFTA award for 1985's Edge of Darkness score, winning six, Record of the Year, Album of the Year, Song of the Year, Best Pop Vocal Performance, Male, Best Rock Vocal Performance, Male, and Best Rock Song, and released the Unplugged album, which was certified diamond after selling 10 million copies. In 2000, Eric collaborated with blues legend B.B. King on the album Riding with the King, which reached number one on the U.S. Top Blues Albums chart and number three on the Billboard 200. The album also won a Grammy for Best Traditional Blues Album. Clapton has been nominated for 37 Grammys, winning 17, and he received the Grammy Lifetime Achievement Award in 2006. He's also earned three American Music Awards, a BAFTA Award, two Billboard Music Awards, a GQ Award, four Ivor Novello Awards, an MTV Video Music Award, two Primetime Emmys, and several other awards. Moreover, Princess Michael of Kent presented Eric Clapton with the Silver Clef Award, and he was inducted into the Blues Hall of Fame in 2015. He was inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame with the Yardbirds, with Cream, and as a solo artist, and he received a star on the Rock and Roll Walk. Could get some ice pack or whatever, it would be fine. This went ramped up from on a scale of 10, say, from three to eight. Eric Clapton was placed number 17 on Surrey Life Magazine's list of wealthiest Surrey residents in 2009, with a fortune of 120 million pounds in assets. This was the result of a mix of income, property, a nine million pound yacht, va bene, his back music catalog, touring income, and his holding firm, Marshbrook Limited, which had earned him 110 million pounds since 1989. He bought a 50% stake in Cording's Piccadilly, a gentleman's outfitter in 2003. Owner Nal Ulof was reportedly trying to save the shop from closing at the time and called Clapton his best client, who responded within five minutes with, I can't let this happen. Eric Clapton's net worth is estimated to be around $450 million. Clapton owns homes in several places, including England, France, Ohio, and Antigua. The Antigua home is known as Stanfast Point, and it was built for $14 million in 2000. The 10,000-square-foot estate sits on 45 acres, and Eric began renting it out for $50,000 per week in 2009. Cars you'll find in his garage include a Ferrari 250 GT Lusso, a Ferrari 350, a 1991 Ferrari F40, a Ferrari 275 GTB, and a Ferrari SBC 12 EC.
Besides his car collection, Eric Clapton owns a 9 million pound yacht.